in the morning announcement, I believe is where we left off. Good morning, everyone! Looks like today is gonna be another perfect tropical day! Now then, let's show some enthusiasm and make sure to give it our all today! Give me one moment, please! Just to double check some stuff. Wait, leave that first. I want to change something real quick. Just want to make it look a little tiny, 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 little bit better. Give me a moment. Overlays. How are you? Uh. Oh, yeah. Oh, plus. Time Uh, mm. This is all right. I, I'm I'm okay with that. Like that. All right. And then the. Okay. Phew! It's been a while since I slept a lot. My head feels clearer thanks to that. Oh, it's a bee. Alright, I should head over to the restaurant. Hello! Mikan! Good morning, Mikan! Uh, hello! Ah, Hajime, good morning! It's almost time to meet with everyone at the restaurant, huh? Right, I'm, I was about to go as well. I'm so glad! I went to check on Fuyuhiko, so I thought I was late. I see. You're so busy this morning. Um. Not at all. I'm only useful in situations like this anyway. Hi, CD! Welcome in! How's your day going? How's Fuyuhiko doing? It might be better to ask you, to ask you at the restaurant when everyone's together. Start, then I shall go ahead. I guess I should go to the restaurant. Let's talk this way. Oh, so many people out here today. Uh, I'm glad it was a good day. Yeah, it's it's not very fun when you're thinking, oh yeah, I have so much stuff to do today and all of this bad stuff may happen, but then it's a good day and then you're like, phew! Phew! But I'm glad you had a good day! Yo, Nekomaru! Your voice is too soft! 
Protect your voice more from your stomach. I'm so sorry. Does he have to be like that this morning? Good, good morning! <laughs> Alright. Now your voice will reach the sun! Oh. And two have departed. Mahiru and Pico. You're right. I'm sure they had it. Huh? I'm just a mere team manager. Therefore, I don't know anything about art. Oh yeah, I was playing Majora's Mask uh, last night and today. And, and I, I got the ocarina. And I can... And that's where I got. I'm a human again. Thank you for letting me play. I never got to finish Majora's Mask before because, because, because I got to... I, I played it before and I got to the water temple and then I missed one of the little fairies and I didn't want to leave without it and then and then and then I got distracted and then I never finished the game. However, when I saw my hero's post, post photos for the first time, <laughs> my vulgar heart was greatly shaken. Truly, that is a splendid thing. It's a pity what happened to Mihiru, but I will never forget how she taught me the value of art. I'll never forget it either! Oh, uh, you're... Oh, is that toilet paper? No, that's in... Oh, I thought it was toilet paper sticking out your, your trousers. Alright, Hiyoko. Jeez. Doesn't it feel like we're forced to meet up at the restaurant every morning? There's something I need to find at the supermarket today. Something to find? Want me to help you? Huh. It's fine. I'm just gonna look for a camera and I'll probably find it really fast. I have a camera. Well, it's a toy camera. That's weird. Really? Um. If that's the case, I probably need a real photographer anyway. What are you planning? Hey, you! I have a, I have a favor to ask you. I guess I'll listen to what you have to say. One second. right after breakfast. Bring a camera too. You've got some free time, right? So it's okay, right? What should I do? I'm free. <laughs> I don't dislike anyone who knows their place. <laughs> Fuck off. Bye. And it's a promise. You definitely have to come. Somehow I ended up making a promise. But is this really okay? I hope she doesn't make me do anything weird. Yo! Yo, Hajime! Good morning! Hey, hey! You're looking better than usual. Everyone I've met is like that too. Did something happen? Well, Fuyuhiko is safe. That's probably why. <laughs> I don't know why, but I feel like I can eat more delicious food than usual. Alright! Speaking of which, why don't I challenge my limits? I'm gonna eat everything in the restaurant. Even though she's not aware of it, Akane definitely looks happy too. Alright. Mm. 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 What's happened? Aww. I'm gonna listen. Hmm? Emergency! I'm gonna listen to songs by Ibuki's favorite artists. There's no TV or radio here, you know. I'm starving to death from musical deprivation. Don't they sell CDs at the supermarket? This is going nowhere. They do. There's only the classics and the usual mainstream pop. <laughs> but at this moment, new albums are plopping out all over the world. I do have this CD, but it's not the kind of music you like, right? Oh! This is... Summer Festivities. <laughs> you must not be scared of anything if you seriously showed me this to me, Hajime. Is there something wrong? Aww. Bah! I seriously can't 
believe you don't know. Hey, hey! The song, Summer Festive, retrieves us by the Black Cherries. Those guys always got hyped as rivals of my old band. Concert promoters would be like Battle of the Bands! An epic showdown between the chicks and the dudes! And they always like to compare their ticket sales and concert attendance numbers with ours. Oh, really? Then? <laughs> it doesn't matter to me anymore since I left the group. Why you? Music shouldn't be reduced to sale numbers. You're right! <laughs> However, thanks to that CD, Ramatron, I thought up something awesome. Something awesome? Yes! Okie dokie, Hajime, I have a question for you. Are you free tonight? What time is tonight exactly? Hold on a sec! I'm the one asking questions here. How are you gonna answer me? I'm free. <laughs> Yahoo! Nice answer. Just as expected from Hajime. Hey, hey! And let's see. Two hours before Monokuma makes his announcement. Let's all meet at the supermarket. Okay? Yeah, I got it. <laughs> I'm looking forward to it! I casually promised her, but I guess it's okay. I shall try not to forget. I made a lot of promises today. Oh, I can't even make this many promises in real life. Hotel Lobby is my friend here. My friend! Oh, good morning. What happened? You don't sound that excited. Cause is playing that arcade machine over there. You can just play together! Mm. Mm. I played one match with him earlier, he told me to give it up my own, so I did, and... I got yelled at for winning that, a flawless victory! He said I was childish for playing seriously against an amateur. Kazuyochi. I wonder which one's more childish? Alright. Yo! How are ya? Are you playing a game? It's rest? see you playing games. Hmm. Well, Chiaki's always into playing it, right? I couldn't help noticing. So, she's letting me play for a little while. Hey, hey. It's not like this. My machine. There's no reason for me to give you permission. You... You say that, but... You're like the queen of the arcade machine. You think so? Really? You serious? You're not aware of that at all? Uh. Well, after getting beaten up in the previous match, I'll definitely return the favor. Nope. You don't have to return the favor. <gasps> what did you say? Are you saying I just have to stay a loser for the rest of my life? <laughs> then let me tell you this. Just definitely catch this topic's bait. You wanna listen, right? Right, 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 right? You just really want to say it. Mm. Then, what is it? Right! Listen and be amazed. There's a street on the third island with lots of busted machines, right? I found some portable game console thing in the junk over there. <laughs> really? Is that true? <laughs> See? What did I tell you? You totally took the bait. Hmm. Still, it looks like this is out of order. Aww. How useless. Hey, hey, hey! Hold on, hold on. Who do you think I am? I'll definitely fix it up till it's like brand new. <laughs> then when it's all fixed, I'll give it to you. Mm. Then I'll wait, but I won't look forward to it. Probably. Hey, 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 Probably hey. look forward to it. Otherwise, I'll be sad, you know. Just watch. I'll completely fix it up. And I'll make you say thank you with tears running down your face. Isn't his intent kind of off? Oh no! Okay, let's look around. Let's go upstairs! Oh, so many peoples! The faces of everyone who gathered at the restaurant all look somewhat light-hearted. Everyone must be really happy that Fuyahiko's safe. Then... 
The day ended halfway yesterday, so let us try to put together our information about the new island. Jeez! In the end, <laughs> that fucking shrine is over there. We couldn't even find a way to escape from this island, right? Seriously, you guys are useless. Yes. But there's a music venue. I see. I got that, but what about the clue that we really need? Tools like information about this island, or anything that might help us understand what's happening to us. <laughs> in the town with all those machines, I found a clue contained within a file inside one of the laptops. You saw that too? Um... I was told about that by Nagito, but... So I checked it as well. This too I saw must it be too. the will of causality. It's about the fact that Hope's Peak Academy has already been destroyed. Eh? Hope, Hope Peak Academy has been destroyed. Wow. It's probably just another one of Monokuma's pranks. There's no way Hope's Peak Academy would fall. But even if it's just a prank, it's not something he should be allowed to do. Damn it. A symbol of Hope getting destroyed is not something you should even joke about. <laughs> well, if you're still wondering about it, it might be better if you just confirm it yourself. <laughs> if I remember to do it, I'll give it a try. How pitiful. So basically, on that island we found no way to escape. Nor any useful clues this time around. <laughs> Hold on, it's this time again, not this time around. <laughs> You don't have to correct this each time. See? However, it is not all bad news. Fuhiko will be able to return to us. <laughs> that guy pisses me off, but it sure makes me happy to think that he's gonna come back to us. <laughs> Ajiyobu. He's recovering extremely well, so I'm pretty sure he can be discharged from the hospital in one week. However, He's probably lost the use of his right eye forever. Oh no. He totally deserves that. Man. Aren't you going a little too far? <laughs> I sure did eat. I'm stuck today. Sheesh. You certainly eat a lot, even without even listening to what the others are saying. Um. Okay then, since I'm stuck, I should go train now. Oh? Train, you say? You hate training. How rare of you. Yo. If I don't do it, I won't get stronger. I have to do it. Bye now. Oh my mom. She's like really pumped up. Huh? I hope she's not thinking about doing anything bad. With that, our morning meeting ended, and we all went back to our cottages. I'm supposed to meet Hiyoko now. What does she want me to do with a camera at the music venue? Hey Hiyoko, I'm here! Jeez! You're late, Hajime! Oh my my! My my! If it isn't Hajime, what's up? Ibuki and Chiaki too, why are you guys here? <gasps> Could it be? Does the cameraman mean you, Hajime? Cameraman? Wait, hold on. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Man, you are so dense. You won't get it unless I explain it to you. You fucking pig shit, stupid human being. Dense or not, it's impossible to find out without a hint or two. Well? Apparently, we're gonna hold a memorial for Mahiru right now. Mahiru? I see. Mahiru I told see. me she wanted to, wanted to take pictures of me jamming on an instrument. And she also said she wanted to take pictures of Hiyoko dancing. <laughs> so we decided to do it all together here. I shall call this the Memorial Jam Session. I see. So I have to take pictures of that. I guess that's a great idea. I'm sure Mahiru's going to be happy. Hey, hey! If you think so, you're gonna accept the camera.
cameraman position, right? But that's a huge responsibility! Hey! Huh? Are you saying you don't want to do it because of that? No, I will! But there's no way my pictures will be as good as my heroes! I'll take as many as I can! Yep! I'll be counting on you. I'll do my very best to play an instrument too. You too? At last, I heard about the idea from Ibuki, and I was just planning to watch. But look, I found this in the storage room. Is that a triangle? Yep. Even I can play something like this, so is it okay if I participate? Right. Instead of watching, I can join you guys. I want to mourn from a hero. No problemo! You don't need skill on this stage, just how? Huh. Well, I guess it's okay. But he was probably gonna be happy about that. Understand? Well, if if you suck, I'm gonna make you stop, okay? And so we finished our preparations, and the memorial service for Mahiru began. Ah! Ah! <gasps> my eyes are crushed by the silent serenade. Even the tips of my fingers are crimson red. <laughs> Jack is hitting that triangle with intensity. The combinations, combination is crazy and everyone's doing different things but strangely. It's harmonizing really well. Even though our paces are all different, will we be able to be like this in the future? Mahiru, can you hear this performance? Are you seeing Hyoko's dance? Not just Mahiru, Piku, Teru Teru, Ayukuya. Are you all watching? We will never forget about you. Ever! And we will not waste your death. We will survive and kill off this island! I finished my job without any problems and decided to go back to my cottage for the time being. Now then, what should I do today? <laughs> Do I go hang out with uh, Ibuki? <laughs> I keep thinking that's a door. Go. Hello. Let's see. Wait. Let me check on my Tamagotchi. Have you pooped? You did do a poop poop. Oh, you silly little goose. Okay, we will hang out with Ibuki, I guess. Be good. You should be friends with Mikan too. I guess. Dead. Can I hang out with Nagito now? Wanted to. Swing by the market first, just in case. I did say I would hang out with Ibuki.
guess not. I didn't check this place fully because I backed out I remember because I'm like oh yeah I want to look at something else quick and then it, got, it put me in the cutscene. It's dark and slightly dirty. There's no point, no, there's no doubt that a room like this would be perfect in a crime movie. If it's just enough. If it's just to stay the night the cottage is good enough. never hung out before because you've always been a little bit unhinged but today's the day I guess. <laughs> I wonder what sort of motive Monokuma is going to prepare this time. Sangel. <laughs> I'm so blessed to hear that you say that about me. I spent time with Nagito today. Wait a second, what does he even like? Check his presence.
Essence, Hope's Peak Wing, a memory notebook, and a knife. I guess Nagito and I grew a little closer today. Yes, I got a present for you. so I could obtain this. I can't tell you how happy I am right now. It's still bright outside. There's no way I should just stay in my room and stand in space. It might be good for me to talk to everyone where, whenever I have the time. Waste of time, we didn't even go up. And we didn't become friends. Pavilion. Wow. There you go. Let me check him. Let me check my Pokeballs. Bye. That's all right. Do I need to hang out with him more? Wait, let me check. Did I really just waste my hangout? I don't know. a while since I played Oh, 
never been in your room before. Animal Crossing. <laughs> Are you like going to everyone's house just because you want to see what it looks like? about studying you. Does he like though? Can't. Drake jacket, bandage, and a stapler. <laughs> Basic first aid techniques. It looks like Mikan and I grew a little closer. I have a present for you! Assembling a manga. Thank you very much! I will treasure this for the rest of my life! Yes! For the rest of my life, I will never wash this hand of mine that received a gift from Hajime! Despite the fact that we decided to hang out, Ikan is acting suspicious and hasn't tried to look at me at all. Somehow, I feel like I did something bad to her, even though I know I didn't do anything. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. What's this all of a sudden? Oh. I thought you clearly looked like you were in a bad mood. Did I do something wrong again? Ah. What should I do? Should, would it make make you happier if I took my clothes off? Well, no. Hold on. Why are you reacting like this? Ah. You're right. You don't want to see me naked, right? Then how about my money? Seriously, hold on. I'm sorry. Sorry? It's no use. I feel like if I start panicking, the situation is going to get even worse. Alright, I should just calm down first. You can. I just want to talk to you normally. Aww. Talk? <laughs> Today is such a beautiful day. Yeah. <laughs> sorry, should I take off my clothes? Please, no! So you don't have to do anything like that. This is troubling. I guess I should start talking to Mikan about something she might get excited about. What type of bandage do you like the most? Bandage? I see. There are lots of different types these days. It's ex extremely convenient because there are waterproof types and sticky types. I definitely like non-elastic types the best. They're not too constricting, but they still firmly secure wounds. I'm glad. Looks like she's getting into the conversation. 
<laughs> Sorry, I went ahead and started talking on my own. Don't worry about it. I'm the one who asked. Also, I feel like I got to know you a little bit more. <laughs> really? Then let's call it a day for now. Hajime! Yes! If it's not too much to trouble for you, I would like to talk to you again! It's been a while since I talked to anyone... Talk, anyone talk to me like this, so please! Of course, anytime. Thank you very much. Thank you very much. Uh... <laughs> we decided to go our separate ways for now. But for some reason, I feel like Mikan was staring at my back a little bit too long. She's not a bad person, but I, re I don't really know how to communicate with her that well. Oh, Hooray! For well, now, I decided to return to my room. It's almost time to meet Ibuki. We had to meet at the supermarket, I should head over. If this was real life, I'd be so Hello. fucking tired by now. Second. Boop. No. Good evening, Mio. Right here, Hajime. Hey, Buki. What's with those piles of cardboard boxes? <laughs> Summer's all about fireworks. Fireworks? <laughs> Gotti fireworks disappear into the sky. It's a lyric from... Christmas festivities. That's totally it! Now, Hajime, let's carry these cardboard boxes to the beach and I'll leave the setting up to you. All of this, just the two of us? Oh my my! You're pretty gutsy, Hajime. Are you saying you want to be alone with me on the beach at night? I didn't mean that. Meow! I'm just kidding. I also invited the others like Chiaki and Akane. I see. Everyone I else see. brought all the fireworks here. We can just leave the rest to Hajime, so Ibuki and the others can change into their yukatas. Yukatas? <laughs> yes! As Sunny would say, Japanese yukatas. If you work hard here, you can see Sonia, Mikan, and Nekomaru all wearing yukatas. I see. <laughs> Looks like some give and take has been established. Hold on, Nekumaru's coming too. If you invited him, then why isn't he here right now? <laughs> Nekumaru helped us during the day. Now it's your turn, so I'll leave everything to you. Hey, Ibuki! She didn't even hear me. I let out a sigh, picked up the cardboard boxes, and walked over to the beach. It's not like I was lured by the yukatas. Oh. Firework disappeared under the sky! Japan summer! Nervous summer! It's gonna be fine. There's no way the sparks will fall all the way down here. <laughs> Nikamaru. Uh, amazing! How wonderful! Huh. This sure is fun! Ah! Uh, hey, hey! Why is Nekomaru shouting like that? Don't you know? That's what you do when the firework goes up. Hmm. That's pretty interesting. You go, girl! <laughs> Was that okay as is? Hajime! Get him up there, Ma. I know, I know. Oh. Once you finish launching that one, I'll trade with you. Enjoy the fireworks too! After having such a fun time, I returned to my cottage with a feeling of satisfaction. It's night time! Ahem! Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make! It is now 10 p.m. Please return to your rooms and relax. Let the sound of the ocean gently rock you to sleep. Now then, sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Good night. It's 
not like I have anything I need to do, so I should just get some sleep for today. It should be okay to have a peaceful day like this for a change. You guys? It's a waste of time to constantly worry about things. Well, if you wanna waste time that badly, I won't stop you. I'm not saying that killing meaningless time is bad or anything. I mean, even happy times, sad times, painful times, fun times, times you want to remember or want to forget, they all end up becoming nostalgic memories eventually. So, isn't killing time by worrying about things an effective way of dealing with that worry? <laughs> You are best at worrying about things and killing time. Ahem! Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. Oh. Good. No, no, no. Hello? What are you doing in my room? Looks like today's gonna be another perfect tropical day! What the? <laughs> what a huge success! Wait, I want the silk cool. I want the oh. I've received such a nice reaction! Epoki, how do you get in here? Aww. You're so careless, Hajime! I made sure I locked the door. <laughs> And I destroyed that worthless lock. What the fuck? Why'd you destroy it? Hey, hey! Look, as more importantly, there's something important I need to tell you. What? <laughs> oh, ha. Ha 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 ha. No, that was just weird. <laughs> if you got time to nitpick others, then hurry up and meet me at the restaurant. <laughs> I'll explain the details there, so I'm counting on you. Like a hurricane. Well, she did take the time to come all the way to my cottage to summon me. Did something bad happen? Feeling a little bit depressed now. Guess we'll go. Two peoples. Hello there. Good morning. <laughs> Even if you ignore me, I'm already happy that our eyes have met. You really are a kind person. Hey. Anyway, after what happened to Fuyuhiko, you understand what I was saying a little bit better now, right? What do you mean? You don't know? Fuyuhiko involved himself in Pico's execution. I did say that it felt unpalatable to me. But Fuyuhiko returned to us alive. It's obvious. He used Pico's death as a stepladder so he could shine even brighter. And cling to an even stronger hope, that spelling mistake. Yo! What? Do you don't agree? Well... It's decided that... What hope should be. That's why you and the others progressed forward. <laughs> we should chat later. We need to be at the restaurant soon. I'll go on ahead. How long does he keep... How long does he plan to keep saying such foolish things? Nakumaru! Nakumaru! <laughs> oh, it's you, Hajime. Were you also summoned by Ibuki? Seems so. Has she been going around waking people up? Did she break the lock to your room too? No! That never happened! I was awakened by a knock at the door going at a 337 clapping rhythm and some shouting. That sounds extremely annoying. Was I the only one whose room got broken into? Huh? But for her to go to the, the trouble of waking us up, what in the world happened? Yeah. I have a bad, very bad feeling about this. Let's make haste and head over. He's right, I should hurry up too. Right after I check my Tamagotchi for pool. Okay. I 
I decided I don't want to be my Tamagotchi. Wait, you ain't got some yet. Let's give you, let's, let's give you a press on. more present. Anything I have lots of. I can have... have... this. Ah, my little baby. I'll make sure I won't kill you this time. first thing I saw was everyone's backs, as if they were forming a circle around something. What happened? As I said that, I peeked over everyone's shoulders. <gasps> I got something I want to say. For you, Hiko, is it okay for you to be moving around like this so soon? Well, you shouldn't be okay. Whatever I say after this point, I apologize in advance if I make a mistake. My last name is Kuzuryu. My first name is pronounced Boo Yu He Ko. I'm still an inexperienced member of my family's business. Ah, uh, it's a formal introduction. From this point forward, I hope we get along so we can get to know each other better. You fiend. What the hell was that? Huh? It's nothing really, just a greeting. There's no way that was just a greeting. And yet, I feel like that was the first time Vihiko ever greeted us. <laughs> the eye patch of yours. Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> that's what, no way, that's nothing since that eye is no longer. Mm. So you can't see out of it. Huh. It's only one eye. Besides, don't I look like I've gained some prestige or something? However. <laughs> Why are you acting all cool and stuff? Don't you understand the position you're in right now? Yoko. Yeah. Do you really think we'll forgive you that easily for what you did? Understand? Don't you get it? It's your fault Mahiro is dead. No, not just Mahiro. Pico died because of you too. Hey. It's all your fault. Oh. Yoko, we've finally been able to get together with everyone. And? So, what if we're all here? You better not say we're friends or something. Shut up! There's no way a killer like him will ever be our friend. I know. It's all my fault. I already know that. It's my fault. That those two are dead. You. Are you planning to just give us your so what attitude? I... It's not that. As he squeezed out those words, Hihiko suddenly collapsed to the ground. For you, Hiko! Huh? What the heck? Hey, don't mess with me! Do you really think we're gonna forgive you if you just drop to your knees and cry? Do you really think a half-assed apology will make us forget what you've done? No. I don't think that at all. <gasps> what? Oh. Uh, hello? This is... No! It's blood! It's blood! Hiko has lit his own stomach! Huh? Ah! Are you saying he cut his own freaking stomach open? What the? What are you doing? I, I didn't think. I've been forgiven by such a 
half-assed apology. But if I don't do this, my feelings won't feel resolved. That doesn't mean you should slash your stomach. You must carry him to the hospital as soon as possible. Kazuchi, lend me a hand. This is bad. Sure thing. Stop it. I can walk there myself. There's no way you can walk. Even though I took the time to patch you up, now I need to sew your wounds all over again. I feel so ashamed. In the end, I made trouble for everyone again. Who cares about that? Let's go! The others carried free he go out of the restaurant. But for those of us who were left there... This is awkward. How should I start up a conversation? Well? Yoko, I've been thinking about this for a while, but... Um... What would Mahiru say about all of this? I know you guys were best friends, so what do you think? <laughs> what would Mahiru say? Thank you for the sub. Welcome in. I missed you, friend. How are you today? Are you okay? What would Mihavu say? She'd probably get mad. Really mad. And after she got mad... I hope, I hope your day's going good and, and everything's okay. Don't worry, that's okay. I know sometimes you get like, especially if you're like really busy or you're not feeling well, sometimes it's hard to reply to people, so you're just like, I'll do it when I can. I get it, don't worry. Thank you for popping in though. I hope, I hope, I hope everything's going okay for you. If not, hang in there. I believe things will get better soon. It's definitely not possible. There's no way it'll be that easy to move on. We never had to think about death until we came to this island. So when we're forced to suddenly confront it, there's no way we'd know how we're supposed to deal with it. But yeah, thank you so much for the sub, Anne Marie. And I'm really happy that you popped in. I'm really happy that you did. We're not that strong. Hey. This is a rare occurrence. If you're thinking about saying something inappropriate again, now's not the time. Okay, I hope I hope you have a nice din din. If you don't come back, just remember you can always reach me on Discord or whatever. Like I'm always around if you wanna talk or just like have a nice chat or talk about anything at all. Like it doesn't have to be like specifically on stream, like you can talk to me whenever you want. No, it's not that. But yeah, I'll catch you later, Anne Marie. Have a good din din. I love you. Does anyone know where Akane is? Huh? Now that you mention it, she's gone. It's so strange for her to not join us for breakfast. Hmm. I have a bad feeling about that too. A bad feeling? I mean, she's been acting a little weird these past few days. She's been training. I think she wants to fight a mono beast, is what I think. How pitiful. She's always weird. Hmm. But I'm a little worried though. She's not the one I'm worried about. An awkward feeling lingered as we finished breakfast. Soon after, we all decided to return to our cottages. I've never felt so fatigued the morning before. It's probably because of everything that's happened. But I should put that feeling aside and move on. There's no such thing as a useless day for us anymore. For <coughs> free time. Who should we hang out? Let's maybe... Not the buttons. Let's maybe... The map. Try Nakito again. Maybe he could be our friend. You can look in this person's room. About Yaki. You can look in your room too. You're right there, so you're not too far. I 
Anna is over at the market, so she's not dead. Go to the beach. There. Go in the hospital again. Then you storage room. There. Let's go into the rooms first. I'm gonna make a second attempt for Nakito. Be fast. Look in your room. Who goes there? What does your room look like? <gasps> wow! It's like the witches! But the put the big elaborate stuff for the mousies. Okay, I'm just looking in your room. Bye, Gundam. Let's look into Yaki's room. As you will. A little bouncy boy. about the bad luck that's waiting for me is making me all tingly! That was a wasted day. Nothing else. else. I gave up on Akito. That was two wasted events. Maybe. I just want him to be my friend. Go hang out with Chiaki. I like her the best. Yeah, still one. I don't know. I 
Can I get closer to him? Tianqi! Are you bored or something? Let's hang out! Well? I'm bored too. Let's think of a way to kill time together. Hmm. Oh, we can to kill we can kill time together. With that I think. I kill time with Chiaki as we thought about different ways to kill time. I have a blast on fire. I have a video game for you. Video game. She falls asleep in such a short time. No! Uh, no! I didn't do it! I didn't do it! I didn't... I did not! I did not! Oh, hi, pretty! Samurai hat. Statue of Liberty. Don't shoot the beam, da! Says bad jumping nation eating up humans! Is she dreaming about a game? I have no idea what kind of game she's talking about. Oh, hi, Mark. I hope, I hope, I hope your driving lesson went okay. Sorry. I think I was sleeping again. Were you playing a game in your dream too? It was fun because it was a shooting game. I see, so you like those kinds of games. Yep. I'm pretty all-inclusive. I'll play anything from Space Invaders to the latest military shooters. I also like simulation games. Right now, I mainly play real-time strategy games, but I like turn-based ones too. Hey, hey! Where do you want to go today? I'm gonna go to the ranch, but I don't really like animals that much. Really? Mm. They're warm when you touch them, you know? That's a little scary. Oh, no. Wow! You have yourself to blame for that! <laughs> you have yourself to blame for that! Why didn't you go to sleep? Why, Prinny? Why? It's kinda hard to guess what they'll do next. Well? I'm better at games that use precise calculations. Did you really? Did you? Where success and failure is decided by numerical values. It's hard for me to play games where I have to manage relationships and guess what characters are feeling. I see. Maybe that's something to do with her upbringing. Have you considered maybe a sleeping aid? Maybe like something to help you sleep? Like a, a my, my melody body pillow? Or, or, or. Uh, sleeping tablets or just like I know sometimes people put like a special spray on their pillow because it helps them sleep I don't want to do things Jackie will hate but I feel it feels lonely to just leave her like this how about how about we look at the animals from far away the ones at the ranch are pretty tame. You can even try to touch them if it looks safe. No! Uh, um, I, uh, but it will be a non-nude one. We don't, we don't deal with the lewd nude. The lewd nude. No, none of that here. Okay. I think. If you teach me a lot of things, it will probably be okay, I think. She will lying on me, if so, that makes me happy. Chiaki and I decided to walk to the lunch. Hmm. It's a cow! I 
one that is gonna dance like the ones in Dancing Guys. Yeah, it's good to, especially if you sleep in a day, that doesn't help you. You need to like reset your sleeping schedule. That might be a little bit difficult. Because the problem you probably are facing is because you sleep in the day, you awake in the night and your body is used to that. I should try touching it a little. Jackie walked up to a cow and cautiously pet its back. The cow seemed not to mind and continue, continued silently eating grass. <laughs> it's a really warm! Well, that's because it's alive. Hmm. I see, you're right. Unlike humans, animals don't mind being touched that much. So that might make things easier for me. If you touch a person, something is born from that interaction, right? Repulsion, anticipation, whatever. I'm nervous about stuff like that. It makes me think I'm better off not doing anything unnecessary. Like it's better if I just stay an innocent bystander for as long as I can. Jackie's feelings seem a little odd, but I do understand where she's coming from. No vampirism! No! You can't do that! You're not allowed! I hope one day she can touch not just cows, but people too! Ah, you know, if we milk this cow, I'm sure that fresh milk must be really tasty. Hey, hey! Milk this cow? You know that milk comes from cows, right? What do you mean from? Milk is milk. You know, if you pull the cow's udders, milk comes out. You only need one cow to get as much milk as you want. Huh? As much as you want. Oh no, I knew this would happen. You'd be like the vampires from Oblivion. Where you just fucking burn in the sun and you look like 50 million years old. You look disgusting. <laughs> but if you try to cut open a milk bottle, cow comes out of it, right? And it dances, right? I knew it. It's definitely dancing eyes. What kind of game is she talking about? I explained how milk works to Chiaki in detail. Why are there so many things she doesn't know as usual? Chiaki is full of mysteries. <gasps> oh, I got a hope for Agamort. Chiaki started to feel sleepy from Playing too much. So after sending her off, I return to my room. Oh, save. No, I won't save. Bleh, bleh! That's you. This pretty, everybody. It's too woo. It's getting dark outside. It's night time already. That felt fast. Oh, I was playing Majora's Mask. I, I got up to, I got up to the last day and I got the ocarina and I'm human again. That's where I am now. Ever since I arrived at this island, a day passes by abnormally fast. <gasps> someone's at the door. Does that mean someone's here? I cautiously walked toward the door and opened it slowly, wary of what might be on the other side. Nice to have met ya! <laughs> it's the past tense of nice to meet you. You know, since we've already exchanged nice to meet you. You again! That's totally it! Allow me to apologize for surprising you with my sudden visit. <laughs> I'm sorry! It's a lot better than last time when you broke into my room! <laughs> you must be the type who holds grudges in my ears and drinks her. That means you have gout. So what do you want? Um... The bookie doesn't get it either, but it looks like an invitation was sent to everyone. Invitation? Yes! See this thing? <laughs> 9pm at TT Typhoon. Is this where we find Melody? Party for Fuyuhiko Kuzuri Use Recovery. 
is totally a girls' fighting. Let's see, a recovery party for Fuyuhiko at Titi Typhoon at 9pm. What is this? Is this Monokuma's doing again? Why you? Don't put that in the same category as Monokuma! Is this your domain? <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about at all. Nipoki just bought the invitation. It's definitely her. <laughs> Nipoki has some preparation, so I'm going ahead. I'll leave it to you. I might play a little... I might do my dailies on Fortnite after this if you want to play... Perini. Like two games. One or two games. You can get the silver sword from the Witcher too. I saw. You have to go on the website and there's like quests and stuff you have to do to get the sword. She even said preparations. She's completely behind this. Chitty Typhoon is that music venue on the third island, right? 9pm. That's in 30 minutes. But even though it's a party for Fuyuhiko's recovery, is he even going to be able to come? After all, he just lit his stomach this morning. But she took the trouble to go to do this out of goodwill. I guess I should head over to the music venue. Let's go. Hello? Wait, let me check my thing. Did you poop? You didn't poop. But are you just chilling anywhere? Yes. Everybody's there. I should just go teleport. Be easier. Recovery. Someone like no matter me. what, I think it's too rude for someone like me to go inside before everyone else arrives. <laughs> you don't have to worry about me, you can go inside first. Believe me, I'm not worried. This too must be the will of causality. Tonight's constellation, Herald the Banquet. Celebrates for your Hickle's resurrection. <laughs> How idealistic! It's nearly showtime! Now then, let us begin the ceremony of darkness. This guy, who cares anymore? I like him though, he's funny. It's a surveillance camera, I didn't mean to click on that. I have a feeling someone's gonna die soon. That's for your heat call! Several people have arrived at the music venue, but... Why are you here? Huh? Is it bad I came? Not that, is it okay for you to move around? It's gonna be fine. It's nothing! <laughs> There's no way you're okay, you're seriously injured. Even so... I took the time. You saw a party for me. There's no way I would have come. But... I understand how you feel, but you really shouldn't overwork yourself. So... I'm not overdoing it. Sheesh! Fine then, let him do whatever he wants. But... Huh? Let him be. Apparently Yakuza have pain tolerance down to an up. I can't believe he's actually forcing himself to join this kind of event. Your free Hiko probably wouldn't have come, no matter how much we invited him. 
He's probably trying his very best to change. I like for you, Hiko. I told you he was a good Ubu boy. I told you. Hey. It looks like Hiyoko definitely didn't come. Oh. That seems to be the case. Huh? And Akane is not here too. Hmm. What is that bald woman up doing? I hope she's not planning to do anything strange. As if on cue, right? When ne Nekomaru expressed his unease, that's when it happened. My! Suddenly, the stage lit up very brightly, and the person who appeared was. Wait. Okay! That's okay, I'll finish soon, and then we can play like one, one or two games. I just wanna do my dailies, that's all. I won't play for long, I promise. <gasps> hey y'all! It's Ibuki Miyota! Thanks for coming out today! My specialty is making beef stew! <laughs> I may not look like it, but people tell me that I'm a nurturing type. So I'm gonna do my very best performance so I can make everyone feel better. I hope you're all pumped up. Just as I thought. That's what she was going for. She is the ultimate musician after all. I can't imagine what else she'd do at a music venue. Alright! I'll start singing this first song with full-on energy! So, put your hands together for... From me to you too! Since she was originally a member of a high school girls band that dominated the music charts, I can probably look forward to her musical stylings. <laughs> oh! Beautiful. We ain't skipping nothing here, boys. <laughs> Happy party dance! More! More dancing! More dancing! Oh no. Thank you everyone. Ah! I'm gonna get close. Look at his face. <laughs> Look at his face. <laughs> what? Such an overwhelmingly baleful resonance. Even my four dark tables of destruction look less lively than usual. Something like this. I too am starting to feel chills. The title like from me to you too. I thought it was going to be a sweet love song. If I recall, the reason why Ibuki left the high school girls band was... Um... Creative differences. <laughs> that must be why. <laughs> it's awesome! That's the first time I've had such a famous song! Yoko! I'm glad. You came. Hmm. But what if I did? I was invited too, you know. But... If you're attending Fihiko's recovery party, that means... You're already... That's not it! Hey, stupid! You pig shit! You pig shit, worthless scum! Don't unders misunderstand! There's no way I'd forgive him that easily. Hey! Cause he's Yakuza, you know? He's the type of person who preys on people by tricking on them. 
We don't love Yoko. Even now, he's probably just pretending to be sorry. So he can try to trick us. So shut the fuck up. Your pictures come back. Please wait. There's no way that is possible. I know. No, I get why she would think that of me. Hm. That's right. That's why we're never going to believe in you. Get it? This doesn't mean we've made up or anything. I'm only cooperating with you until we get off this island. So. Just remember, if anything happens, you're the first one who's gonna get cut up. Sorry. Stop hurting my oval boy! I'm glad. I'm really, really glad. Nasty don't pig cry. <laughs> Pigs don't have the right to cry. You're grossing me out! Fucking disgusting! I see. Yuhiko's not the only one who's trying to change. He's also trying. Yokiyoko. There's no way she would have even ever forgiven Yuhiko like this. Gross. What are you looking at? But Ubu? Ubu? Fuhiko. Nothing. Somehow, even though it's little by little, I feel like things are starting to turn around. But that's all the more reason to worry about him. Manakuma. There's no way he's not going to do anything while he's watching us like this, right? Boring. How much longer are you guys going to be bummed out? I came all the way here because you said it was a party. Yay! Come on, Ibuki. Hurry up and start the next song. Roger! Thanks for waiting! Let's go right ahead to the next song! Ah, oh, Poopy Poopy Yama! Poopy Poopy Yama's dead! Didn't you see? They died! It was really... it was so so sad! Huh? There's still more? Now that this recovery party is in full swing, I've got a ballad prepared that totally fits the they mood! They died! Yeah! Poopy Poopy Yama killed Mahiru! Because, because she is a uh, Fuhiko's sword, so to speak. She is the bodyguard for Fuhiko and they grew up together ever since they were little babies. And she knew that Fuhiko was gonna kill Mahiru or wanted to get revenge because Mahiru killed Fuyuhiko's sister. But they forgot the memories, but then they found out. So, for so Poopy, Poopy Yama was like, I'll do it. And then she killed, she killed Mahiru. And then, and then, <laughs> it was so sad. And then they were like, oh, but you, you can just throw me away. I know I was worthless, I'm nothing. And, and Fuyuhiko was like, no, that's not true, I love you. And then, and then Poopy, Poopy Yama was being executed. And then Fuyuhiko ran to try and save her. And then he got her. And that's how he lost his eye. Grab a partner and slow dance to... I squeezed out the baby, <laughs> but I have no idea who the father is. <laughs> I squeezed out the baby, but I have no idea who the father is. This is my favorite song. Stop it! <laughs> What's everybody doing in here? Wow, Manomi! Jeez! It was super sad too because because Fuyuhiko didn't want her to do it, but Poopy Poopy Yama did it anyway because she wanted to protect Fuyuhiko, but she wouldn't listen, and she just thought she was a worthless nobody, and all she was was there to like kill. I protect for Fuyuhiko, but Fuyuhiko was like, "No, I love you. You're my best friend. I don't want you to do that for me." And then, and then Fuyuhiko was in the hospital and then he was so sad and he just, he was just crying and he turned around in the bed so no one could look at him. Now he's trying to be everyone's friend because he wants to change and be better. What? I wasn't invited to the party. <laughs> Off 
obviously not. You'd ruin the party if you were here. What? Wow. But seriously, now's not the time. That's not the time to enjoy a fun party. Why? <laughs> Akane, Akane is... Emergency! Akane is drilling Monokuma! What? What did you say? <gasps> At this point, Akane is gonna be in danger. Please, do something to save her! Mm -hmm. Looks like my bad feeling was correct. <laughs> that stupid fool! No, I'm the one who was a fool. It was my mistake to not keep my eyes on her. <laughs> As a team manager, I should have had a proper grasp of my athlete's private life. Damn it! This failure will haunt me for the rest of my life, or my name isn't Nekomaru, need I? Um... Now is not the time for regret. Let us make haste! Of course! Damn it! Fihiko finally returned to work, but to have anyone else in that group getting taken away! I won't allow it! I'll never allow it! Oh no, where's Akane and Monokuma? Um... They're at the beach where we arrived at this island. <gasps> Howie, if you don't, Akane is gonna get killed. <laughs> don't have to tell me, I've got full speed ahead. See? Should have it. Uncle Maru bolted from the music venue as fast as his leg could take him. And we followed him soon after. I should have it too. Everyone! Uh oh, uh oh, oh, I'm going. Thanks, everyone. No, oh, that's not it. I know Akane is in deep trouble, but you guys suck! <laughs> Go this half baked comfort. If this were a sun tile, it would be salt seeping into my broken heart. <laughs> oh no. I don't really get it, but you look pretty bummed out. <laughs> Come on, you shouldn't make a fuss here. Let's hurry over to the beach. He's right, I should hurry. Let's go! In a minute. Let's go! In a minute. Let's go! Go! Ah, long. It's just as Nikomo said. I can't stand any more situations where someone is taken any longer. There's no time to spare. I need to hurry over the beach at the first island. <laughs> I'll, I'll grab a drink. Just let me have a drink first. I'm thirsty. Oh. Wah. Oh. Wah. Ha. Show me your sweet dance moves. D damn it! Well, why can't I even graze you with my attacks? Well, you know, we're on completely different levels. That means we view the world differently. It's like a character from a punk manga challenging an enemy from a super-powered battle manga. <laughs> it's obvious you can't win. Oh, no! Hey, hey. Is she really serious about... Not even grazing it. Akane is fighting a stuffed animal. 
Monokuma is an advanced machine. If it's designed for combat, it's probably capable of exerting such power. However, as far as speed is concerned, Akane is far faster than any athlete I've ever seen. She says she can't even graze him with her attacks? Is that even possible? <laughs> However, because it's possible, that's why she's in the situation, right? How unfortunate. As long as she's ended up like that, there's not much we can really do about it. At the very least, we should overcome the despair of Akane's death and use it as fuel to bolster our hope. Right? Like for your hickle did, you see? Don't fuck with me! Damn it! I never want to feel that feeling ever again. If I have to feel that way again, I'll make sure I stop it. Even if it costs me with my life. Ah! You can't. You'll really die if you keep overexerting yourself. Yeah. It's just a little life Pico gave me. It's not precious anyway. <laughs> you idiot! That's all, more, that's all the more reason you need to take, take care of it. Huh? Oh? Don't stop me! You guys stay back. I'll take it from here. This is Nekomaru Nidai's final firework. Make sure you sear it into your eyes. Everybody looking? Ah! Now then, it looks like everyone's here, so I might as well finish this. Didn't I say I won't allow any rule violations against me? This is what happens when you break the rules. Disappear. No! The world shook and turned dark white. Can't believe you blinked! As if the surrounding scenery and every sound was blown away by the impact. It was all completely white. And within that white, I heard a voice. Ah! Uh, uh, ah! Nekomaru! Oh no. N Nekomaru! Why did you. S say. <laughs> Isn't it obvious? Hi, Pete! Welcome in! You're in another set. You came at a good, bad time. A bad time, maybe a good time. It depends how you want to look at it entertainment wise. I hope, you, I hope you're doing okay. Supporting their athletes is a manager's duty. However, what a shame for someone like Nekomaru Nidai to. It was just a little shot from a bazooka. I really am the worst. <laughs> get, get a hold of yourself, Nekomaru! Nekomaru! Ah, uh, yay! Jim time, Jim time. Akane, the time I've spent with you, it, it wasn't so bad. Ah, uh, he likes her. Don't. Die. <laughs> he was the poor man. <laughs> it's true. He had a piece of paper sticking out of his pocket, and I thought it was toilet paper because that would be on brand for him. Nekomaru! Ah! Ah, uh, you? Kidding me? Ah! Nekomaru died! <laughs> That's... Holy crap! Oh no. P Pinny, did you just threaten Pete? Did you just threaten Pete? <laughs> Dead of the rule violator, Akane? What the hell? What a major failure! I ended up killing Nekomaru! Who had nothing to do with this. Hey! Hold on. It's faint. But his heart is still beating! He's not dead yet! <laughs> you gotta hurry and tweet him! Well, now, come you. on, you can do something about this, right? Save Nekomaru like you saved me! Hey, hey! If you kill someone who didn't violate the rules, that makes you the one who violated the rules. <laughs> oh no. Fourth day in a row. I hope you I hope you have a break tomorrow. 
You need a rest. Well, then let's just say we're even. Huh? <laughs> In exchange for forgiving Akane for breaking the rules, let's just say Nakamura was the sacrifice. So, isn't it okay to say we're even? Hey. You're not gonna save him? Unbeatable. Guess I have no choice. It's annoying, but it'd be boring if he died a meaningless death. So. Only for today, I'll activate my special trump card! And that's when it happened. A siren started ringing out of nowhere. It gradually came closer and closer. It's the ambulance! Oh, uh, this again? Just leave the rest to me! Dr. Killgood! He even recycled the same line again! We gotta get this patient to the Monokuma Hospital ER and get him under 24-hour observation stat! Look. Pinny changed, okay? Ever since Pinny started playing Fortnite, she's a changed person. She's just so violent and bloodthirsty. So, I'll see you later. And after he said that, the ambulance containing Monokuma and Nikomaru vanished from our sight. What the hell? Why did this happen? What's going on? He's gonna be alright, right? Nikomaru's gonna be saved, right? Of course he's obviously going to be saved. Uh, but for Yiko finally returned to us. I cannot believe Nikomaru is gone now. No! I can't stand this anymore. Hey! You can stop yelling. Screaming won't help, you know. Cause, cause... Go. This isn't cause. This is whatever happens. This is what happens when we let our guard down. All this talk about getting along. We were just fooling ourselves. <laughs> we were just pretending we understood the situation we're in. Teamwork, friendship, cooperation, nothing matters. The stupid ones will just get killed one after another. It won't be a mystery when you're eventually betrayed. That's why I'm never going to rely on anyone. That's the reality here. <sighs> Are you saying it is meaningless for us to even work together? Shut up! If it really did have a meaning, Nekomaru wouldn't have ended up like that. <laughs> he ended up like that because of his weird feelings of friendship. You... You understand that too, right? When the stupid ones try to act on their own, it makes trouble for everyone else. I like how she keeps calling Akane stupid. Hey! So can you please not involve me? I don't want to die a meaningless death. That is... Yoko, blaming Akane will not help solve anything. Huh. We don't have to worry about Coach Nekomaru. Huh? Huh. That's the disappointing. It's all your fault and you're not even worried about him. Oh. You're not worried about Nekomaru? Damn it! There's no need to worry about worrying. I know Coach Nekomaru is a monstrous guy. There's no way he's gonna die from something like that. There's no doubt. Nekomaru is definitely gonna come back. Damn it. So when that happens, I'll make sure to I'll, I'll, I'll make sure I'll apologize to him. Cause I was too weak and I caused him trouble. When he comes back, I'm I'll make sure to say I'm sorry. Akane. Okay, so nobody's dead, that's good. As we all returned to our cottages, we were silent. Even if we opened our mouths, only words of worry would come out. We all knew that. When we saw Nekumaru's tra tragedy happen right in front of us, once again, we were all taught. If you think you won't die, well, that's just wishful thinking. On this island, without any warning, people die. That is the nightmare we're trapped in. Not, <laughs> not yet. <laughs> Is that another threat? <laughs> when you think you've finally woken up from the nightmare, you realize you're still inside it. And thus, the nightmare continues. Super! Manakuma Super Fable Story 58 A Tangle Came Down From The Mountains A long time ago, there was a village that was afraid of Tengu showing up. The 
tangles apparently did as they pleased, such as stealing food and kidnapping women. But is it really the tangles' fault? Isn't it actually the humans' fault for ruining nature by destroying the mountains where the tangles lived? You think monsters are scary? It's humans that are the scary ones. Everyone, now is the time to rise up against the humans. We must protect nature from the humans and return the world to a peaceful place where monsters roam free. Bring it on! Malakuma Super Fables, the end. Some morning. Ahem! Hope Speak Academy School Trip Executive Committee has an announcement to make. Good morning, everyone! Looks like today is gonna be another perfect tropical day! I will. Should I play a little bit more? Or should I end here? I'm very tired from talking a lot. I might end here. And. I will definitely not miss streaming next week. I promise. I promise I'll do it. And then we can make more pro progress. I'm not lying this time, I promise. I think I'll stop here. A fluette. Let me catch this Pokemon first. You have to wait for the fluette. I hope you liked the stream, everybody. There a lot, a lot of things happened. A lot of things happened. So, Fuyuhiko came out the hospital, and then he was like, Oh, let me introduce myself. Let's be friends. And then Hyoko was like, Fuck off. And then, and then, and then Fuyuhiko slit his stomach to make people happy because no one was forgiving him. And then he went back to the hospital. And then we had we hung out with lots of people, and we had a memorial for my hero. And then and then Akane almost died. And then and then Nikomaru went to the hospital. And I'm pretty sure someone's gonna die soon. But we'll find out next week on Monday. I promise we not on Monday on Tuesday. I promise on Tuesday. Gonna wait for the Pokemon to be caught first. I don't want to miss it. But on Saturday at 9 p.m. GMT, we'll be watching Lord of the Rings, hosted by Perini, the Madras Primrose. I hope, I hope you will look forward to it. And 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 thank you for watching, everybody. And I hope you have a good night. Bye!